We always knew the range, uh, the general area in the book where we wanted to split it. Um, we did go back and forth a little bit sort of within, I would say, five or six scenes. Mm. Um, we kind of bounced around just a little to test the, the, the right feeling, um, but I think I'm, I'm really happy with the way this one ends. So I'm, I'm pleased with the result. One of the themes for sure is really that you can sort of see the, the kind of power and the kind of change that just one person can have. I mean, I think, you know, we, we experience these movies through Katniss's eyes, and I think she's somebody who is, at the beginning of the film, just starting to understand what she means to the rebellion, but still doesn't quite believe it, which I think makes her, a, you know, a very relatable uh, character in, in the story. Um, and then partway through the movie really starts to understand, oh wow, I am really important to these people and I can make a difference. And that's when she finally embraces being the Mockingjay and starting to make a real change. Um, and I think that's one of, the, one of the important themes and could possibly galvanize kids. Jennifer's character has been through really horrible things. I mean, at the opening of Catching Fire, she had some post-traumatic stress. She has to go through the games again, so obviously she has you know, even more post-traumatic stress at the beginning of this film. Um, but she's also been betrayed by the people that she trusts. She's in a foreign place. Um, you know, so what the, she and I would do is really just look at the situation and try and be as honest and as real as possible. And we spend a lot of time talking about the arc of her discovery of what she means to, to the world, to her world, and how she takes that responsibility on. In, in terms of, uh, of losing Phil, uh, you know, it was a horrible, horrible thing. Uh, he was a friend, he was a great guy, he's a fantastic actor, uh, and it was something that we never, we never got over, but it's, uh, he was almost done with his work, and we're not doing any kind of digital trickery or anything like that, so that we didn't have too many scheduling issues whatsoever, but it was just something that we, quite honestly, never, never got over. She's very involved all the way through, and I have to say it's fantastic because she's, um, she comes from screenwriting and playwriting and TV, so she understands the difference between a novel and a screenplay and how things have to change. She was also really open to and supportive of the world expansion that we've done, so she always thought that was really fun because it's not really a change, it's kind of expanding the story and getting to see things that could have been happening um, during the course of her book. So she was very open to that, but what she's fantastic at is really tracking all the characters. And she really, really, really knows the characters and their emotional and psychological states. And so if we ever started to sort of get off track a little bit, she was fantastic at sort of being our anchor and bringing us back in uh, uh, with Katniss or with Gail or you know, with anybody. She was, uh, she was a fantastic partner in this.